right now then my friends I'm in Wales in Holyhead on the Isle of Anglesey and I haven't eaten all day and I've never ever had fish and chips in Wales so that's what I'm going to do today we're going to do a little bit of uh, exploring around see what Holyhead's like and um, get some fish and chips now I've done my research I've done a bit of research I've done a recce I've had a little walk around I've seen a nice little fish and chip shop I think it's called Prince's or Prices it's around the corner just down the street looks a nice little place did a little bit of research a little bit of tippy tapping seeing what it's like gets a good write-up so I think that's where we're gonna go we're gonna mark it out of ten I want you guys to mark it out of ten as well the big question is now I've had fish and chips in England I've had fish and chips in Scotland and I've had fish and chips in Cornwall as well which is still in England but what are fish and chips like in Wales? Well, we're about to find out. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, click that little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos, and subscription's free. It's not like a magazine. Now, without further ado, my friends, let's go. exploring this looks like the main street we've got the co-op there uh, clear shoes bet Fred of course um, holy moly cafe quaint little street a lot of people speaking uh, in the Welsh dialect and quite a few. Oh, there's a bridge here as well look at this There we go, so it says uh, this dramatic landmark bridge links the town centre and the edge of the inner harbour crossing over Victoria Road. Uh, shape has been inspired by Celtic designs and the 190 metre steel and concrete footway is supported by 18 steel cables from two large arches of one metre di diameter stainless steel tubing. There you go. Anyway, it's not getting as fish and chips, is it? Come on. Wow, what a beautiful church. <laughs> and I think, even better, the chip shop's right behind it, so come on. <laughs> Great pub. I tell you what, I've noticed there's quite a few pubs around here, and they're really, really like proper, proper pubs that I used to see in the 1980s and 90s. No weather spoons or anything like that, proper boozers. That's what I like to see. Oh, look at this one. Abbott vaults with like the tiles on the outside. It's like we've gone back in time. It's brilliant this, I love it. Right, here we are. Price's Fish and Chips, established 1935. Fantastic, can't wait for this. I mean, I literally, I've just had a breakfast biscuit all day, come on.
Right, here we are at the oldest chip shop in Hollyhead. And we've got Tina here, uh, who's very kindly said she'll be on the video. Now, you've been here 18 years. 18 years. 18 years? Yeah. Blimey. Part and of furniture. You're part of the furniture now. It was so, sold with me in it. it was so, <laughs> <laughs> so you've got to come and see Tina. <laughs> so I'm going to have fish and chips, a curry sauce and a mushy peas. Um, and uh, I think we've got two curries. Got to, oh, you got oh now you're confusing it. Got two curries. Go oh, on then. Chip shop or Chinese? Oh, I've got to go for mild or spicy. I go for a bit of spicy actually. Bit of spicy. Is that Chinese? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go for a bit of spicy then. So I'm looking forward to this. Can't wait for that. <laughs> Oldest chip shop in in uh, in Hollyhead. 1930s. Wow, 1930s. Well, it's been here a long time. Come 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 in and <laughs> say hello to her. There we go. Brilliant. Are you from here? Yes, I live by the school. But where's the accent? Can you speak in, in Welsh? Like that? Well, my, my parents are English. Ah. So I was never, you know, they spoke to me in English. Oh. My son's Welsh. Yeah. He can speak Welsh. Okay. So, but me, I, I can understand a bit, not a lot. I could have done with you earlier because I'm charging my car up and I'm pressing it, it's all in Welsh. There is no English thing. I'm like, what? And I'm thinking, where's the, I'm being typical English, where's the bloody English? It's like, <laughs> it's what we expect. It, 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 it is. Well, I couldn't work it out, but I mean, I am from Mansfield, so it's probably. Uh, I've seen them all. Yeah. <laughs> See. Anyway, I'm looking forward to this. Now you see, she even asked whether to wrap the fish with it. Now that's a professional, that's a pro that is. Right, that's it, brilliant. I shall see you later. See you later. Got my fish and Enjoy. chips. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> bye bye, bye. Wow, that's really good price as well. £10.60, fish, chips, cooked to order, mushy peas, curry sauce, got some napkins, uh, got, got a fork as well. Gonna head back to the car because my car's just about finished charging, or it may have finished charging right now. Um, so I'm gonna head back in case anybody else wants to get on the charger. And uh, we'll mark these out of 10. Come on, looking forward to this. What a lovely lady. There we go, go and see her. If you come to Wales, Hollyhead, go and see her. Tell her I sent you, there we go. Right, I reckon, because my car's down here, that I can get down these steps. There's nobody waiting by the looks of it for the electric car, so charging points down there. So, let's go and take the car off charge. See if we can find a, somewhere to eat them as well. Somewhere I can relax and eat my fish and chips. The first fish and chips I've had in Wales. Looking forward to this. What a lovely lady though. I love, this is what I love about this channel and doing YouTube is meeting all these different people along the way. It's not just the food or, I've said that before, it's, it's meeting different people along the way. It's fantastic, I absolutely love it. Right, so I've moved the car. Um, that's all moved, napkins in here. Uh, fork, plastic. Let's open these up, wow. Find a nice little wall to eat them on. Let's pop this out. Oh my word, there is loads of fish and chips on here. This is, this looks like there's a lot of food here, I've got to say. You know, I took my blooming fleece off. I thought, oh, it's a bit warm. I've took my fleece off. Now it's a bit chilly in the, uh, in the shade, I've got to say, wow. Not in a, t oh my word, look at the size of that and the fish and the chips, absolutely. Amazing. Just take a closer look at this, my friends. Right, here we go. I tell you what, first things first, peas. 
you're not going to see them from out of space, that's good. Uh, we're going to go in for the peas actually, let's go in for the peas first. Oh, beautiful. Right, let's go in for the fish, nice and crispy batter to say that it's been in this, wrapped in this for a while. Just look at the size of that fish. <laughs> look at that, huge. The chips look good as well, not scrag ends, all cooked to order. Oh, beautiful chips, look at that. Look at the out of them, look at the outside of them. Let me try and get the camera there, look. Just look at this. That fish and chips looks lovely. It is. What are you doing on TikTok? I'm on YouTube. YouTube. Brilliant fish and chips. <laughs> Where'd you get it from? Uh, Prince's. Prices. Prices. Best fish and chip shop in Anglesey. Best fish and chip shop in Anglesey. See this guy says it. Look up yeah. the Mac. Look up the Mac Master. There you go. Cheers. Good luck. Thank you. What's what? your YouTube channel called? The Mac Master. Mac, M-A-C. Emmy's Macmaster. The Macmaster. Cheers. Yeah. There you go. Even he says it. Prices. Spot on. Them chips are brilliant. Crispy on the outside. Fluffy. Look at that. Going to go in for the fish. Oh my word. That's unbelievable. The fish itself. Just look at that. Look at the flakes of fish there and how thick that is. And the batter itself, not too greasy. Mmm. Oh, God. Wow. These are on another level. I'm going to go in for some curry sauce now. Now, we went for the spicier one. So, good consistency of curry sauce there. Mmm. Oh, hey. Wow. Whales. Unbelievable. Oh. These are... I think these are some of the best cooked chips I've had because they don't look anemic at all. Look at that. Superb. Right. I'm going to eat these. Come back to you. And mark them out of ten, but... I'm, I'm really impressed by the chips because a lot of chips these days and I've seen it in the comments section you say they're anemic but these aren't look at them but still light and fluffy on the inner superb right wow we'll see you guys in a minute we're going to mark this out of 10 mmm Right, I think I can wrap this up because <clears throat> these are absolutely spot on. I've almost finished them. Um, no skin on the fish. I was looking at that. No, 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 oops, thought you were going to fall there. No skin on the fish. Um, the fish was superb. The batter was lovely. The chips, as I've said before, amazing. Not anemic at all. Slight oranginess to the, to the outside of them. Um, curry sauce perfect, mushy peas lovely, service in there the lady amazing. Um, I know I'm throwing a lot of tens out here um, but I can't think of any reason not to give these um, a ten to be fair because I can't get them down me quick enough um, I mean I haven't eaten all day but the batter stayed crispy even though I carried it back from the fish and chip shop they stayed warm and hot because um, they were cooked fresh to order. Um, I think price-wise, spot on really. Uh, you can't complain in this day and age. Um, it's got to be a 10, fantastic. Um, so there you go, my first fish and chips in Wales on the Isle of Anglesey in Holyhead. And it was 
Prices, wasn't it? I keep calling it Prince's, but it was Prices. Prices Fish and Chip Shop. Um, two Cent CYBI Street, Sibby, Sibby, Sibby. I'm sure you'll correct me in the comment section down below. That's all from me today, anyway. Uh, if you do pop out for the day, come and, and you're not far, or you, you do you know what's worth getting in your car? Come and just drive to Wales, go and see the lady and have some fish and chips. Fantastic. And again, small business. Happy days. See you guys in the next one. By the way, car's fully charged. Hmm. Beautiful.